This is Aaron, and this is the Phase AI. Make sure to like and subscribe. This ball, phase two, with a shiny cover, polished cover, and uh, AI beefed core, which means it's gonna have a little bit more continuation and uh, throughput through the pins. It's a phase two, it's smooth, I like it. It's shiny, it looks great. I mean, it really does. Uh, reminds me of, um, gosh, I forget that, what that ball is, but I like the white, I like how it swirls. Oh, uh, uh, punch out. Punch out, yes, the punch out. That's exactly what I was thinking of. Let's throw another shot here. It's very clean and stable. It does not jump off the spot. I don't know why other reviews make it seem like it is, but for me, on this, it's really stable. It's pretty forward, just like a phase two. And again, it looks beautiful. I'm gonna move another two left here, get deeper into the lane, and let's see what it does. Super smooth. When I'm bowling on tougher patterns, I like to see balls that hook early and kind of roll off of it. This is gonna be a great complement to the phase two. Phase two is gonna be game two, game three, when Fronts are hooking a little bit too early. Got to move a little bit left, but not deep. This is going to be perfect right after that when the fronts, maybe you're bowling out of center where the fronts are hooking a lot. You need phase two type motion that's smooth, but you want to go to something that's a little bit cleaner to get past the fronts and you don't want to loft it. It's going to look great. Got a little bit right there, still came back. Saw enough early hook again from the phase two cover, uh, but shiny, so it did have enough responsiveness. If I threw a phase two there, probably would not have gotten the 10 out, but because it's a pearlized cover and the AI core shaped enough to get the 10 out. Gonna move another two, three left here, slow down my feet, get my hand around it more, see what this ball can do. That was a really good shot. Unlucky leave a nine pin, but it looks great. It looks really good. I really like the shape that I'm seeing. And overall, I think this would be a great ball for everybody. I'm gonna try to move back to the right, even though it's a little bit burnt. I wanna see if I can throw it faster and see if I can get through all the stuff. That was pretty good. I did see it hook a little bit early because there is, we're bowling on a little bit of a burn, so it's a little bit, Hooks early, but it looks good. I like it. It didn't jump off the spot when I saw friction, so it was a little bit smoother. You'll see that in the camera. So I'm gonna move it even more right, throw it faster, see what it does. That one got a little bit left. It's fine though. I'm gonna move all the way back left because this ball, I think it'll be great from left. It's gonna be great from the middle part of the lane. It's not going to look too great from the right because you are going to see early friction. It might jump off the spot because it still is a pearlized cover. Even though it's smooth, it's still going to jump just a little bit. For me, it's going to be great left when I need to open up my angles, get through the fronts, and just have the thing jump back to me. As you saw there, it did not make a huge jump back again because it is a phase two but it did come back. It did have plenty of core left to get through the pins. AI core really does help in improve ball motion. So again, let's throw another shot from even further left. Flat 10 there, it's 
So when I get super far left, where I'm loft in the left gutter, it does get a little bit squirrely, doesn't see the friction all that much and jump. But we're gonna try to finesse our hand a little bit and see if we can get around a corner. I'm sliding about 35. See there again, left a 10 pin, still got back to the pocket. If you have a little bit more revs than me, then it probably would come back. Got a little, bit, just roll it more. I'm gonna move back to where I was, where it was striking, and let's see if we can keep striking. That looks pretty good. This ball is great. When I am in the right place, at the right time, with the right ball speed, it does not miss. It does not miss the spot. Let's see if I bring up my ball speed. Let's see if I can continue to get 10 out. A little bit faster there. Did not see early enough because it is a pearl, pearlized cover. Did go a lot cleaner than a phase two would have. So I, you, when you do throw this ball, you either got to stay right and catch the early friction or you got to slow your ball speed down so it does hook early enough to catch anything that would be there. So after that shot, move one or two left, slow ball speed down, and it should strike. Even when I miss in, it strikes. Got a little bit of hold in the middle there. Looks pretty good. I wanna see how far left I can get. I'm gonna move 10 left, loft the left gutter, get my hand around it, loft it up in the air. Let's see if we can get it left to right coast and get it to come back. If I can do this with this ball, you guys should subscribe right now because there's no point in not subscribing. It's free. Come back. Oh, there's a 10 pin. I'm gonna do that one more time. It has enough to get back. I know it does. I just gotta make it do it. If you guys wanna pick this ball up, go to your local VIP pro shop, get one now. You can order one at Bay Area Pro Shop if you live near close to us. I will, I will sign your ball. I will kiss it, make it roll great. Slow down. There it is guys, that's the Phase AI. Brand new ball from Storm. Pick one up at your local VIP pro shop whenever it releases. Have a nice day, like and subscribe, peace out.